and welcome back to The Whistle, Episode 7, with Coach Pollock and Coach Hart. Back here for number 7, baby. Lucky number 7, Coach. Lucky, number, Lucky seven. number 7. Hey, before we get in the show, I just got to ask y'all, you know, how was uh, Freak Nick doing your spring breaks? Oh, man. <laughs> oh. Hey, I saw all the comments yeah. about my stuttering when Freak Nick got brought up. So, oh, uh, is it? Whew. <laughs> A lot, brought, of a lot of comments. Yeah, a lot of comments. A lot oh, of comments. I miss those yeah, comments. A lot of comments I'm going to start reading more. About comments. my stuttering during the, the Freak Nick uh, mentioning. But uh, anyway, um, hey. No, don't be, anyway, don't be jumping past that. Let's talk about no, that a little no, bit. Wait. No, we don't want. Okay, <laughs> never mind. All right. Listen. There's going to come more comments for you, people. So we were on, we were on spring break last week. And uh, I tell you what, um, apparently, apparently, the word I got when I was down in South Georgia is everybody has moved from – Panama City down to Seaside. So now Seaside has has, has got them a mess on their hands. Man, they, spring breakers, man, they just can't act right these days. I don't know what the deal is. They just can't act right. Well, they was going to find them a spot. Yeah. They, they, you know, that, they, they plenty, of, away. They they find plenty of coastline, and they found them one. They found them one. You know, but, um, one. you know, we've been, we've been back for a few days now, had a couple practices, Coach. Mm -hmm. And, uh, man, we got to go outside yesterday. Good Boy, meal. that was nice. It Man, that was nice. I'll tell you what. People don't understand. You see 50, but it's not 50. It's like no, 60. Exactly. 60, like 70. That's yes. sun out, man. I think that's what Colorado is, right? Sunshine or snow. Sunshine, exactly. Either one or the other. They, but it, it melts right away, though. Like That's they, right. They not. That's right. And Coach Pollock, you know what we did their first day outside? What's that? We mic'd up. Coach Hart. Oh. So I'm going to drop some of that right there here. There you go. Got Coach Hart on the mic. There <laughs> oh you go. Oh, my goodness. I don't know what I, I got, said. Hey, I can't wait. I, I can't, can't wait. remember what I said. I can't wait. If you, if, wait. Hey, little kids, if y'all there, listen to me now. That that That's an alternate ego of this smiling face you that's see right. right here. That's so right. I'm not sure what I said, but don't you worry. When I recruit you, you're going to be my best player. That's exactly right. I want to correct exactly you, right? right. We're going to do a holy buddy goody. Y'all already got a drink of water. Two lines on there. Two lines on there. One line here, one line there, right? Here we go. Here we go. Drive it through now. Drive it through. You first, bet. Be ready, Coach. Buzz feet. Here we go. Ready, set, hit. Boom. Get down. Ready, set, hit. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Ready, set, hit. Come on, come on, come on. Drive through. Wrap up. Ready, set, hit. Boom, come on. We're going back, going back, going back. Ready, ready, set, hit. Boom, good. Ready, set, hit. Last one. Good, let's go. Time, that's time. That's time, baby. That's time. Y'all should be good and winded. Y'all should be good and winded. Thank you, thank you for doing your job. I appreciate it. It looks good when you do it. Ooh, they not probably be on the field over there. They ain't probably be on the field now. I don't know if Cole going to say something. I bet if I get on the field, I get, I, I, he get on me. Hurry up and get lined up. We got to hurry up and get lined up. Get there. Get there. Get there. Get there. Hey. Hey. Stay square when you do it. When you turn them in. Next rack, get in. For twos. Get in on team. They was talking about some other stuff. I see it on film. I know I saw the explosion. Where that big run come from? Uh, I hit that B gap. Bo, what happened with it? They all blocked down. I don't know. I think it was the air. We had, we had a, I came and hit my We had a sky call to that side, too. A sky you know, call? I didn't get no sky call. No. Well, they ain't got nothing to do with you. You still, you're on the other side. They ain't got a sky call. Yeah. yeah. They blocked down. All right. So we got a force, force by the safety, right? Force by the safety then on that? Yeah. Sure. Well, hey, Coach, listen. We're we going to kind of pick up where we left off on, on our last episode, but we got a lot of feedback about our uh, our NFL list. And a matter of fact, our great leader came in here and uh, he had to adjust our cornerbacks a little bit. Okay. Okay. Coach, Coach Prime came in here and he adjusted our cornerbacks a little bit. And uh, as you can see, we've got Prime, Revis, Rod Woodson, Mel Blunt, and Mike Haynes on the list. Mike Haynes? Who? Mike Haynes from Mike the Raiders, Haynes. baby. Yes. I remember they had Mike Haynes on one side, Lester Hayes on the other, man. That's right. You know? That's right. So, but yeah, Coach Prime came in here and he he felt like that uh, that we we were disrespecting Mike Haynes by leaving him off the list. Got and you know, him. I hate to say this, when one goes on, one had to go off. Yeah, yeah. So we, we had to take Daryl Green off. Daryl Green had to take Daryl Green the off. List. You know, Daryl left the list. Left the know? list. But, hey, uh, we also want to say just because we want to be politically correct here in Colorado, 
uh, honorable mention. Well, 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 wait a minute. I may not want an honorable mention him, but uh, Peyton Manning. We're gonna we're gonna help you out. Yeah, for quarterback. Oh, yes, sir. Peyton Manning. You got, you got Elway up there. We got Elway. We got Elway up there, man. You got Elway up there. He got two Super Bowls. We know Peyton Manning came in here what? and got you nothing. Hey, you know? since, since we since we gonna try to get the Broncos a little love, we can we can honorable mention a cornerback with Champ Bailey, right? Champ Bailey. Champ Bailey, former Broncos, Champ, Champ Bailey Georgia was a dog. Bulldog, South Georgia boy of mine. Champ Bailey was a dog. Shout out to my boys back I, home. I, I, I give you that coach. That yeah. was a good Champ one. Champ Bailey that was a good, 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 good player. Good. Who who we on now? Who, who we talking about, Coach? I tell you what, Coach. Since since we 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 haven't talked about tight ends, and we okay. we you know we ain't talked about Taylor and Travis in a while, so. Let's let's hit up them tight ends, man. You know okay. we got we got hey Travis Kelsey and Gronk at the one two punch right there, man. Travis Kelsey and Gronk is the one two, but I tell you what, it was really hard. Well, it's a lot of good ones. It out was there, really coach. hard. Missing some, yeah, I know, coach. I mean, look at that list. We got Kelsey okay, Winslow got, number three. Okay, we got Kelsey at one, Gronk at two, Winslow at three. All right, reach back for that. That's good. Newsom. Ozzy Newsom. Ozzy Newsom. Newsom reached back four. And then Tony and Gonzalez. Gonzalez at five. Okay. I mean, listen, we left George Kittle off. Well, yeah, you got, you, mean, what about the now. shock doctor? Shocky. Uh-oh, Shocky. Jeremy Shocky. Dang. You forgot Jer I ain't oh, think about him. and then uh, my book, y'all got to help, in the comments, y'all help me. I don't know if I'm going to know this coach may know it, but I can't remember. My tight end. For the Giants, was that Bavaro? Oh, that was Bavaro. Hey, listen, let me tell you. Go, let me tell you about Bavaro. Bavaro's story. Back in the day, uh, I know you. We got a lot of man people out there, but back in the day on Tech Mobile, if you <laughs> played with the Giants, they had this little play with Bavaro hooked up in the corner in the in the middle of the field. You couldn't cover. You couldn't tackle. You could not either. cover and couldn't tackle Mark Bavaro. Okay. Now I'm here to tell you. Don't have. Uh... Uncle Shay Shay up there, Shannon Sharp. Oh, Shannon Sharp, oh, another Bronco. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yes. Shannon Sharp. Shannon Sharp. And a Hall of Famer. Gold jacket. Left the gold jacket off yeah, a Bronco yeah. with that. We are terribly sorry. Terribly sorry. And he's another Georgia Please boy. Please forgive us. Yeah. Another Georgia he's a Georgia, boy. He's a Georgia and boy. And he played at Savannah State, HBCU guy. He sure did. And he's yes, an sir. HBCU. We, we got to do something about this. Please. Tell you what, Can we go so, top seven? So if you were going to. Maybe top eight. You know what? If you were going to go Shannon. Don't do it. No, I'm just, I'm just don't hypothetical. Do it. Who would you take on? Oh, don't do it! Oh, Lord. He did it. Who the, would you take on? The off? thing about it is now Sharp has two Super Bowl rings. Mm -hmm. And them last and three. And jacket. Yes, them last three, if I'm not mistaken, none of them have a Super Bowl. I know fact, Gonzalez does it. Did it, Winslow not get one? No, the Chargers never have one Super Bowl. One. And the Newsom, Newsom played for the Browns. So we know, we they, know, they, they, know. Ain't know they ain't got one. Browns you know what? i tell you what. I don't, I don't know. Um... Well, then if we're going to – now, see, hold up now. Now, wait a minute now. We're not factoring Super Bowls, is we? <laughs> no. Because, see, that's when the argument is. That's right. Who won Super Bowl? Who won, who won this one? Who won, won that? That's right. I don't uh, – if we got to – I'm going to say – It's tough. Good Lord. We just might have to add three more spots. <laughs> I believe so. I believe so. Uh, I, I think I mean, we can say the top two are the top two. I believe that. I believe Kelsey. Is it, is it in that way? I don't now, know if it's in the right order now. now is that because of Taylor? Order. Does Taylor have anything to do with Kelsey being number one? I don't know. So y'all let us know in the comments. Tight ends. Are we one and two in the right Okay, list. well, let's do this. Let's do this. Because I see a lot of – I need to go back and review the tape. Y'all review the tape with us, fans. But I see a lot of guys caught a lot of balls. I only see maybe one, two guys on there who were blocking. I can promise you that top one don't block. I <laughs> <laughs> Listen, <laughs> hey, hey, let me go tell you. <laughs> hey, if y'all want to see some funny stuff, get a wide angle of a Kansas City Chiefs game and watch Kelsey when the ball ain't going his way. That boy is, like going hey, listen, that. he might as well be in the stand. He might as well be in the box with, with, with Taylor because he's watching. There I can you tell you. As a matter of fact, in the Super Bowl, I remember one play that they actually had him in the hip of the tackle and motion him out away from the ball to yeah, run it. To run it. I knew, hey, I knew as soon as they, they motioned him out, I said, they're going to run. run, run, yeah, run that's that's right. They were trying to pull somebody that's out right. the box. That's right. And that's what that's they right. did. I don't know. Gonzalez didn't block that much. Yeah, no, he didn't. But uh, Newsom was pretty dang good. Yeah, Newsom was a dog now. Newsom was a dog. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you. Like, I'm, he pretty good. He's a pretty man. good player now. Now, Winslow, the charge, that was an error rate. I don't think he blocked either, though. Yeah. yeah. So, ooh, here's a great question. In your top five, whether it be tight ends, running backs, oh, and maybe let's say receivers too. Maybe not so much receivers. 
the main receivers too, doesn't matter if they were a full player, meaning they caught the ball and they blocked. That's right. Does that matter to you? And do they run routes when the ball ain't going to them? Do and they do run they run routes? Speed. Like, does that matter? Now, this is coach stuff now. This I ain't tell just, you now. This ain't fan stuff. Kelsey, just seeing Kelsey don't. Kelsey don't. Because I can tell you, on the winning play in the Super Bowl, he's looking up at the at the billboard, at the uh, the, the big. Um, he was. Uh, uh, Jumbotron. Jumbotron. Yeah, he the was. Jumbotron. He was. Watching, he watching McCole catch the ball. He was. He, he was. Now, I, I, I graded him on that. He I, got a minus. I, I gave him a minus on that. I, get, I gave him a minus. a minus, minus, because he had a loaf on that. That's right. Yeah, he loafed. Minus. You know. But uh, y'all want to go to one more category on yes, this? Sir, one? Yes, sir. Yeah, I tell you what. I tell you what. Hey, hey, D tackle. In honor of one of our new additions. Oh yes. In honor of one of our new now, additions. Now when Warren Sapp come in here and he see he too. <laughs> he gonna he gonna move some furniture. He gonna move some furniture. I ain't got nothing to do with it now. All right, so so D tackle. Joe Green. D tackle. Hey, there's so many great D tackles. That's mean Joe Green now. Mean right? Joe Green of uh, the Steel Sad Curtain, Grand 1970s. Ooh, that's a good one. Pittsburgh Steelers. You got Bob Lilly. Oh, Bob yeah. Lilly and Randy White. And Randy White. You know we cowboy. Two cowboys. You know we cowboy <laughs> fan. And, and let me tell you something. Don't hate. Go back and watch them boys play. Give them respect for the, the, the time they were in there. Now, Randy White was dominated. the Randy White boy. That joke was yeah, a monster. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> he and did it, run run. Listen, it, they, Bob Lilly in a lot of lists, when you look it up, is ranked number one or two in a lot of lists. Mm. The boy, the man could play. But I tell you what, you know, we uh, um, obviously we got uh, Coach Sapp at number two. Uh, right up there with Joe Green. Aaron Donald, 10, 10 years, 10 Pro Bowls. You know, then you got Bob Lilly and Randy White, the two Cowboys. Coach, I tell you what, man, what it was about, hard leaving Jerome Brown. Jerome Brown, I was about to say. It man. was hard leaving it Jerome was four Brown. Four years, but it was four of the most impactful you, you years of my a, life. You got a couple from the Purple People Eaters. Yes, sir. Purple, Purple People, people yes, Eaters. Sir. That's right. John Randall. Mm -hmm. John Randall was a bad boy. Well, we consider Deacon. Deacon Jones. Deacon is a is Deacon, he and he's okay. on our list. He's on our Oh, he's on the list. Okay, he's on our All right, all right. Yeah. What about a refrigerator, Perry? Big Perry. Perry did I, offense, yes, defense. Yes. I mean, he was. He was yes, yes. But when I you get this, a nickname coach, like that. I, I hear what you're saying about the fridge, but as I look at your list, I don't see somebody I would take off for him. No, no. He was a bugger. You yeah, couldn't but, but run I don't off. see somebody I would take off, though. That's the what? Problem. That's the problem. So, like, tight ends, I see a name I would take off for right. Shannon to go on. Okay. D right. tackles, I don't see one I would take okay. off. Absolutely. The man, to go on. the man played. I, okay. The man played both sides of the ball, y'all. You got to understand. Everybody hey, and their mama knew right. <laughs> who was going to get the ball on the goal line. Yes. Could they stop yes. him? That's right. They could not. That's right. On defense, he was the most athletic big man I'd ever seen run lateral and could plug a hole and you couldn't move him. Okay. So you could not move him. Coach, I hear you. Name me. One of them guys that can do that, play both sides of the now, ball. I'm gonna and do flip, that. on behalf of the fans. I'm gonna flip it to you. Tell me who you taking off uh -oh. for a freeze to go on. Mmm. Here we go. <laughs> I tell you what. Well, man. I tell you what I'm gonna do. I tell you what I'm gonna do. After tough. these messages, <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> I'm trying to figure that out. I don't. Ooh. I tell I'm you what. Let's, let's just face it. It's hard at some position to pick five dudes. Yeah. I mean, it really is. Man. Yeah. They. There's just so them. many great You're players. You're right, Anthony. I can't take them. There's so I, many I, great players. I can't really take you one know, of If I was going to do one, it only would be Bob Lilly because I haven't yeah. really seen As a matter of fact, we tape on Bob. Yeah. But that's that's we, bad we, on me because I haven't done my research. You know well, what I'm saying? So, we originally had D-line as one category, and then we just got the list of people. Yeah. And, and, and we, we had to break it up. We had to put two different groups, you know. But uh, anyway, we – um. We got we got through a couple of categories. We're gonna save a couple of categories. Oh, you know who I know who, uh -oh. who's probably a number one uh cornerback in college though for the Colorado Buffaloes? Uh oh. Mr. Dion Figures. Oh, yes Deion he did. Figures, yes sir. Yes he did. Rick Myers. Yes, sir. Y'all remember the play. Yeah, baby. Picked him off. Dion uh -huh. Figures, yes sir. Number one cornerback, won that game for him, sent him to championship. Yeah, y'all think I'm doing my research. I'm here in Boulder, y'all. He, hey, he, he got this right. He's got an award prime guy. He did, didn't he? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah he, sure got, did. he got the same award prime guy. We, we walk by it in the lobby sure, every morning. We, so we do, don't we? Throw up award. Yeah, he got so it. You got to get a man his props. Got to get a man his gotta props. Got to get his props. Got to get a man Well, coach, I'll tell you what, man. Hey, we are in the middle of March Madness. And, boys, let me go and tell you right now. I don't know if I'm more excited about the men's tournament 
for the women's tournament. That's a lot. That's a lot. I'm more excited about the women's tournament. I ain't going to lie to you, Coach. They shaking them up. Listen, Monday night, I was tuned in. I was watching Caitlin Clark and Angel Reese. I was watching people. Paige Becker it's and Juju. People. I'm telling you right now, I was, but hey, I was locked women. in. I had my phone on silence. I wanted to see them girls play. And coach, let me go on tape. All of them put on a show. They some bad women. I mean, women. they put on a they show. They some bad women. You know, You're talking about crossing folks over. Hey, listen. Caitlin Clark. Come out the second half and just lit the gym. She come out the locker room shoot. It bad. Come out the locker room shoot, and then you know, of course, Angel. She get she hurt her ankle. Coach, twenty rebounds. Really, 20, 20 rebounds. You know, you imagine rebounds. being UConn women's basketball. They've been to the final four so many times. I didn't realize this till last night. They don't even cut down the net no more for the final four. Like they just leave the net. Everybody else cut the net now. They I guess they run out of room. They've been there like twenty something times, right? <laughs> I tell you what, though, that was a good. That was a good night for women's basketball. Oh yeah, that was four great teams going at each other. Some really, really talented players. You know, really talented players. Hey, I'm just mad at UGA because they let Flage get out of Savannah. Yeah, let her get all the way to Baton Rouge. I'm like, that gone. Come on, hey Flage. That's our second stop. Flage, I need you in that portal. Get back to Athens. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I tell you what else y'all gotta do. Cause I know we gotta go. I gotta go to a meeting with some. But look, just to be better for you guys, right? But this is what you got to do. You got to come out for spring game week. No doubt. It ain't whole week. Get, it's we have week. Lil Wayne we here. Got, uh, we got all kinds of stuff. Lil Wayne, Boosie. Uh, uh, then we had, we had that, Lil Boosie here yesterday. Who was here yesterday? Oh, Yellow Beezy was here yesterday. Yellow Beezy was here yesterday. Yes, yeah, sir. From, from the hood, man. Yes, yeah, sir. Yellow Beezy was here. That's on me, oh, baby. Y'all yeah, know. Yes, sir. Yeah, research that. Y'all need to try it. And Bad Low, Bad D Low, somebody. I yep. can't think of name. He's coming right. too. He coming. Y'all know him. Youngsters know him. I'm gonna get name right though. I won't want to worry about that. Uh, who else is coming? We got a picnic. All kind of food. Yes, sir. Yeah. Thursday through Sunday. Sunday. Thursday through Sunday. That's you can't, right. miss, can't miss. You can't it. miss this weekend. Now. I don't know what y'all doing. That's that. That's the weekend of April 27th. We got more shows. Lead it up there so you're going to be constantly reminded. Absolutely. And, constantly reminded. And the next whistle, we're going to get into some more of these categories. Absolutely. That's right. That's right. Hey, and then, and then the next whistle, we're going to have the uh, NCAA Champions Crown, so we can talk about that in the Final Four. And we'll, we'll, we'll be locked in. All right. Locked in and ready to go. Well, guys, listen up, man. We got to get to work. We got meetings we got to get to. We got to get to the meetings. <laughs> hey, we got to get the buffs ready. Got a big scrimmage tomorrow. Looking forward to seeing everybody. Let's go, buffs.